What's going on YouTube? Mr. 1T back with another video, you guys. And in today's video, we're going to be opening up something really, really awesome and epic. It's almost pretty much basically a mystery box sent by someone over on eBay. And I call him a pretty good friend, if you ask me. Uh, you guys should definitely check him out. We'll get into that in just a second. But before we do, you guys, I really need to clear this up right now. Next weekend, we will be opening up this Sun and Moon Celestial Storm booster box, you guys. It has Rayquaza. We got the, the Coal Mine. We got the Blaziken. We also have a Jirachi in here. A lot of really cool cards. Uh, we're not going to be doing the Italian booster box because it just didn't get enough votes. I, I don't understand. You guys all voted for it the other day on my poll. But then when it came to like real talk, nobody really wanted to buy packs for it, which is totally fine. Doing the Celestial Storm box next Saturday, July 24th at 2 p.m. Central Standard Time. And the pack per price, the pack for the pack. The price of the pack is going to be $17 each. So if you guys want to buy some packs, go ahead and shoot me a DM right now on Instagram at trainer underscore Mr. 1T or shoot me an email at the email in the description of this video, you guys. I don't want to say my email out loud, but you guys can see it in the description of this video, you guys. But today we're going to be opening up this mystery box that I have received from locomotive underscore breath underscore y2k over on ebay uh i was like hey man this guy is super cool honestly like there are some really cool people on ebay who used to work for like pokemon wizards of the coast this guy was a judge at pokemon tournaments you guys he would be like judging the tournaments while people were like battling it out so this guy has an insane collection of never before seen product to like the normal average joe like myself that wants to go into the store and buy some packs or or like when you go to target or walmart you only find a few things no 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 whenever they did like pokemon tournaments i know it's gonna be shut down till i think 2022 like these guys get exclusive uh tournament prizes pins badges uh different coins even promo cards some really expensive promo cards that you were only able to get in tournaments so we are going to be opening up this mystery box if i can get it open i'd i want to hide the shipping information so i'll just tilt it this way let me just move the camera here for one second you guys you can see me opening it here on this side of the camera but i did want to release a video since we're not going live this weekend i know i'm pretty bummed out we're not doing a live this weekend but it was just really difficult to find a box to open up for you guys and when everybody voted for the Italiano Glazizion Plasma, the Plasma Freeze black and white Italian box. I was so shocked that so many people voted for it. I was like, are you serious? I mean, I'm down, but it turned out you guys weren't all that serious and that's totally fine. So I'm, I'm, there's nothing wrong with opening up a Sun and Moon booster box. It is whatever you guys want to do anyways. So I'm going to move the box on the side, put the camera back in the frame let us do this like that. Very nice. I will have his eBay in the description of the video. And you should also see it somewhere here at the bottom left corner. It's going to be displayed throughout the whole entire video. Well, because this video is because of this guy right here. Okay, well, we found a piece of cardboard. Rainbow, Rainbow Richards Pokemon Mystery Box. Hey, that's the title he wants to give. That's the title we're going with. Four items equal nine hundred dollars holy chicken on a stick you guys i'm gonna be honest i paid six hundred dollars for this so let us see what this man put inside for us oh my goodness i already see some pretty cool stuff look we have a world's 2005 charizard metal coin i hear some jingling and jangling we have a nintendo power ho o -Oh pin set very interesting okay i love how he put this all inside of here we have pop series packs one through four unfortunately we didn't luck out with the pop series five i mean they are pretty expensive so what can you really oh my goodness look what we have here you guys he even sent us some german unseen forces ex unseen forces art set four packs so we'll definitely be getting into that okay wow we're jumping right should we jump right into the bonus items Oh man. Oh wow, this is awesome. Let us 
let us get into these first and then we'll make our way into the bonus items you guys i really want to see what's inside here and i want to open up some packs i don't want you guys just seeing a bunch of folded up products so let us start off with the world's 2005 charizard metal coin oh man here we go oh here it is right here look how tiny that coin is i mean it is a coin Get the lighting down a little bit. There we have it. Oh my god, we're gonna have to... It is no longer 2005! What the heck? <laughs> this does not want to rip. Hello? Alright, we got it out. Here we go. Here is the Charizard coin. Look at that. That's pretty cool. And you can see right there at the bottom, it does say 2005 Pokemon Nintendo. Oh, baby, look at that. World Championship 2005. Wow, that is awesome. We'll put that right there in the back. Let us see what we have here. The Nintendo Power Ho-Oh pin set. If you guys don't know already, I do have a pretty nice pin collection. I've been going, I've been collecting, for example, these EX pins. These are exclusive to like the Pokemon tournaments. Oh man, look at this. Wow, Pokemon Gold and Silver Pin, Nintendo Power. Wow, the year 2000 right there. That is so cool. We got Togepi, Pikachu, and of course the Ho-Oh. You guys already know o oh, I'm gonna be opening up this bad boy. So let's do that. What's the mystery box where you don't open up the product that you get inside, you know what I'm saying? So we are opening up everything. Let's see. Oh, wow, look at this. Okay, how do you get this out? Oh, chicken on a stick. I broke the Togepi. <gasps> oh my gosh, look at this. The Togepi just came right out of there. That is such a beautiful pin of Togepi. I have never seen anything so vibrant and colorful like that. I love the blue and the red. I want to get this out of the... Dude, that is so cool. What is this for? So I guess you put this in here like this. And then you close it. It's like a Pokeball. I'm assuming it closes. Hello? Hmm. Wow, look at that. And then I think you can probably put this on like a backpack or something like that. That is so cool. We got a Togepi pin. And of course we have the Pikachu pin. Right here, we got Pikachu as the pin. Let's get him out, Pikachu. I choose you. There is the Pikachu pin, you guys. Very nostalgic, very epic, and I think this is pretty ex exclusive, if you ask me. I've never really seen anybody open up this product. Wow, so we have the Pikachu one, and of course, the legendary Ho-Oh. I just killed Ho -Oh. Chicken. Not actually, though. Here he is, he's okay. Oh, wow. This is so cool. Look at this Ho-Oh. That is so epic. I love his wings. Orange and, and green. Beautiful pin. Wow, this will look really nice on my pin board. I will have to definitely do a collection video soon of all the pins that I have. I have a lot of pins at this point. So there we have it, you guys. Three of the pins in the back. Should we go get into some... Pop series packs, you guys. There we go. It has been removed. We have one, two, three, and four. Oh my goodness. I think I'm going to try. I think I'm going to hold on to these and try to get uh, Pop Series 5 packs. Hopefully. We'll see. And then that way we can do like a one through nine. We can open up one from every single Pop Series. So I actually really, really, really am excited about this. Oh my goodness, here we have four German EX Unseen Forces booster packs, you guys. I think we should go ahead and open up some of these packs. I'm going to start off with the Typhlosion artwork. And if you guys recall, last time we opened up these German packs, we actually pulled ourselves an Espeon <laughs> EX. Very, very beautiful. So let us go through one pack and see what the card trick. I believe it's still two to the front, but I'm not 100% sure. I am forgetful a bit. 
So we have a Majit on Farage. We have a Macargo, just Macargo, Mac Cargo. Oh, chicken on a stick. That's not the hollow, that's an uncommon. We got ourselves a reverse Larvitar. Look at that. Oh, chicken on a stick with the Pokeballs and the reflection right there. Do you see that? That is so cool. Wow. Very nice. And then are we going to get a rare hollow? Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Oh, we actually did get a rare hollow. <gasps> oh my God. Oh my God. talk we got ourselves a german suicune gold star you guys oh my gosh oh my gosh <sighs> oh, that just happened oh, oh. i'm so sorry for the screaming you guys oh my goodness there is a print line going through right right through the card y'all can see it maybe right there who cares if there's print lines? I don't really care. At this point, I have pulled so many dang gold stars. Oh my god. A Suicune. I'm spitting everywhere. Ew. A Suicune gold star. The centering is phenomenal on the card. And there are no white dots on the back. <gasps> Whoopee. Whoopee. Oh my god. I need a top loader. I am sweating like a maniac right now. I cannot believe that just happened. Holy chicken on a stick. Oh my goodness, you guys. Suicune Gold Star. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my goodness. Let's get through the rest of the pack. What the chicken on a stick? Oh my goodness. Shout out to you, Richard. Oh my goodness. This is the best mystery box. I have ever opened up Pupitar, Teddy Ursa, Scorgol, and a Miri Apple. Okay, no problem. Just pull the Suicune Gold Star over here. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling like a villain. O M G. Card one fifteen out of one fifteen. <sighs> oh my god! I'm gonna. I'm. I bet that. <laughs> Wow, that is probably so cringe if I when I watch that back, when I edit. Oh my goodness, you guys. I can't believe we just pulled a gold star. I want to post about it right now on Instagram, but I'm not. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't believe that just happened, dude. Holy moly, you guys. Wow. Okay, so yeah, I mean, I know for a fact this guy doesn't weigh packs. And that's what I like so much about some of these... Uh, different sellers that you can find on ebay you just gotta do your research and always look at the feedback like there are a f like a very minimum there's minimum there's a very few amount of people i buy from on ebay because i know they sell unweighed packs and the majority of the people that i have purchased from that i know are sell unweighed packs i have gotten gold stars from them so you know always no, always do your research when you're buying stuff okay we got a yanma so we a Yan yanma followed by a Coruscant. Corsola in English. We got another one down there. This one looks like they are afraid to swim in the pink pool. But not to worry, we have a Suicune Gold Star. I'm still shaking a little bit. Oof. <laughs> I'm so sorry, you guys. This is so cringe. But just roll with it, please. Holy chicken on a stick, you guys. I think we're getting to the reverse. Oh, my God. We got a reverse rare Ariados coming in pack number two, you guys. I honestly love these German packs so much. I cannot believe we just pulled a Gold Star Suicune. Holy chicken. Can we get something else? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Come on. What do we have behind here? Okay. All right. We can, we can re relax, guys. It's okay. We got a Kusila Smoochum. Rare non-hollow. 
We got a Sonkern, Voltilan, Lampy, Energy Switch, Hunduster, and that's it, you guys. Oh my goodness, but not too bad for the reverse slot either. We got ourselves a reverse rare Ariados, and I just love the pattern on these. Look at that. It looks like he has his home built. He's got like a web shooting out of uh, like his butt area and he's like pretty much protecting all the pokeballs or maybe the pokeballs have pokemon in it and he's actually a thief that would be pretty cool to see like a little story behind that oh my goodness you guys where did i put that where did i put larvitar uh hello where did i put the larvitar Did I drop Larvitar? Yo, am I blind or something? Where is Larvitar? <laughs> oh, I didn't even put Larvitar in a sleeve. Man, I am such a terrible trainer. Get in there. Boom. Out of two packs so far, we've gotten these two epic cards. Oh my goodness, this wasn't supposed to be a long opening. I still can't get over this. Suicune is one of my favorite of the three legendary dogs, followed by Raikou and then Entei. Who cares about Entei? Suicune is such a sweet name, and he looks so majestic. Wow. Wowie, wowie. And we still have two more EX Unseen Forces German booster packs to go through. Let's go through the Raikou booster pack next. Maybe I will do the card trick this time so we can go through all the Pokemon. So it should be uh, two. So... The first two, and then this should be the reverse, and then this should be the rare. What if we got another gold star? I would be happy with anything at this point. I cannot complain. I cannot complain at all. I cannot. We have a Fear Beagle. Ooh, that looks pretty awesome. I don't even know what this card is in English. We got a Shoot Send... Shoot Sendy Kugel. We got a Tanza. Porygon. Doflor. Trank. Hunduster, I think we're coming up on the reverse. Oh, wow, look how beautiful that reverse card is. Professor Lin's Trainings Methodon. Look at that, we got the Gen 2 Pokemon starters in the back. We got Chikorita, Cyndaquil, and Totodile. Look how beautiful this is. Oh my goodness. I swear, these look a lot better than the English version of these cards. Wow, and then for the rare, can we get another holo or not? Ooh, non-holographic Cramarks. I believe that is uh, Murkrow in the English language. Oh, wow. We are... We got one more pack to go, you guys. Oh, man, imagine he sent the Pop 5 and we pulled a gold star out of that. Holy chicken on a stick. Oh, my goodness. I wasn't really expecting much, but these have been such a treat to do. And we still haven't even gone through the whole box. We have the... Uh, we have the bonus items that he submitted as well. So we'll just put the first two to the back. Okay, last pack, last EX German pack that we have. Oh my God, I think I see something shiny back there. All right, let's see. Let's see if we can get something else. We got a Lantern, Energy Wurzel, Voltilan, Evoli, NDV, Chikorita. There is that Larvitar. We got a Pieppi. Reverse Shuckle Potrot. And then further rare. Is that an EX I see back there, you guys? Oh my goodness. Come on, Shuckle. Give us some good luck. Three, two, one. <laughs> no way. Let's rock. Let's freaking go. Oh my god. We got the Feraligator EX, you guys. Are we still recording? Oh, thank god we're recording. Thank you, Jesus. We got the Empurgator EX. Oh my gosh, I'm speechless. I am speechless. The centering is not too shabby. And the back is also not too shabby. Let's go, guys. Yo, if you are enjoying this mystery box opening, smack that like button, you guys. Oh my goodness. Wow, let's get this in a top loader right away. I don't know if I will grade these cards. I'm not too sure. I'm still waiting on like 115 cards that I submitted in like July of 2020. It's 
It's been a year since they've been gone. But I can quickly summarize my pulls. Let me put this shuckle in a sleeve. And we'll see what we have for the bonus items. And if we have enough time, maybe we'll just go ahead and open up these packs right here. Okay, so we got one rare hollow reverse, Ariados. We got the awesome epic looking Larvitar that summoned the Suicune Gold Star for us. We got the Potrot Shuckle Reverse and this awesome Professor Lin's Training Method Reverse with the Gen 2 Starters. Very, very nice. And then the highlight of the four EX packs that we got, definitely this for Alligator EX that I pulled last pack, Magic. And the Suicune Gold Star, you guys. I still cannot believe we actually pulled that. So I'm going to actually just set these right there in the back. We can put these as well in the back, just like that. And we got all these commons and uncommons. Very, very nice cards. Uh, we will keep them as well. Let's keep going and see what else he packed in here for us. Okay, so it seems like there are Pokemon cards. What? I don't know what this is either. There's a note inside. What the heck is this? Look at this. This is what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh, Pokemon Coliseum? That's like from the, the Nintendo 64. What do we have here? And last but not least, he has included... I believe that's it. He has included for us some stickers, you guys. Look at this. We have, uh, this is the Pokemon Tournament uh, Company. This is what, what it was called, Pop Organized Play for the Pop Series Packs. Actually, look at that, just like that. Just like that, Pop, Pop Series. Look at that, that's the e-readers. We got the city, state, and national championships. We got the World Championships 2004, Gym Challenge, Stadium Challenge. We got Rayquaza and Torkoal. And then here we have some more city, state, and national. And we got a Zigzagoon too. Can't forget about the Zigzagoon. Let me open this up real quick and see if there are other stickers. Oh, wow, he just sent me two lots of stickers, you guys. Who doesn't like stickers? Oh my goodness. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna remove the stickers at the moment. Maybe one day in the future, I will give them to my future kids. So we'll put the stickers back. Oh my gosh, you guys, I cannot believe we actually got a gold star. All right, and what are these? Okay, here, we'll put these here. We have the Pokemon Fan Spring 2004 Pokemon Coliseum. Dude, it's like it was meant to be. <laughs> I can't make this up. I cannot make this up. All right, what do we have in here? Table of contents. Welcome to the Pokemon Fan. Okay, so get ready for the battle of a lifetime. We won't read this whole thing. Pick your best Pokemon and get ready for the ride of a lifetime. Coliseum Guide. Oh, wow. It's like a little, uh, oh my gosh, look how nostalgic the uh, graphics were on the A and B button. He's Here's all the Pokemon, I guess, from the Coliseum game. Wow. It tells you right here at the top. There's Shadow Pokemon. Are they all Shadow Pokemon? Oh my goodness. Look at the upcoming sets at the time. Like... Team Magma and Aqua. Here we have EX Sandstorm theme decks. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is so awesome. Look at this awesome limited, ad only 100 available Pokemon Coliseum watches. Yo, that is pretty, that's pretty dope. Let's see what else we have here. Oh, we got the Jirachi Wishmaker. Very epic. We got some Pokemon toys. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, don't. Wow, what is this? That's the tin, dude. The EX, the I think that's the first Pokemon tin in the English side that they released. <gasps> Toys R Us, Leaf Green, Fire Red, Pokemon Fan Magazine. Oh my goodness. This is so freaking awesome. Did he include... Oh my god, there's Torchic! Torchic! We love Torchic! Because the best freaking Pokemon in the world! Oh, look at that. There's the Charizard EX right there. Are you missing half the fun? Yes, I'm missing half the fun. Dude, we are embracing the fun. Oh my goodness. Should I color this one day, you guys? I'll color Venusaur like green. Maybe I can color Rayquaza blue, Charizard purple. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. So 
look at this. We'll just look at all of them. We got the Deoxys from 2004. We got green is good. I'm assuming this one is in regards to the EX Emerald. And then, oh my gosh, we have XD is here. Pokemon XD, Gale of Darkness. There is the Lugia right there, you guys. Oh my goodness. This is so freaking awesome. I didn't even know things like this were around. So I'm going to be keeping these forever stored away. These are so epic. Holy chicken. Which one is your favorite? Mine is going to have to be the first one we looked at just because we pulled the Suicune Gold Star. But let me know your favorite. All right, let's continue on and see what's in here. This is crazy. Nine EX series pre-release cards as an upcoming listing as in upcoming listings on eBay. Ooh, so this is what you can expect to find on his eBay page. That is awesome. Okay, let us see what we have. It's pretty dense. I mean, nine. Oh my gosh, okay. Just throw the paper. Holy chicken on a stick, you guys. These are EX pre-releases cards. They would uh, give them out, I I'm assuming at like tournaments and stuff, like, hey, like this is what's upcoming in the next or so sets for the tournaments and for the trading card game. So here we have a Tentacruel pre-release card from EX Legend Makers. I, I have the set names memorized by now. We have a Delta Species Matang from of course EX Delta Species. We have Grumpig pre-release stamp right there you guys from EX Emerald. We have the Team Rocket uh, Dark Houndoom from the EX Team Rocket Returns. Uh, set and lastly we have the swallow oh wait oh dude oh my gosh <laughs> wow okay so there were oh there's nothing behind here we have the bay leaf from ex unseen forces of course i had to do a double take on that and then we have the manectric from ex deoxys that is so epic and then behind here we also have the war turtle from expeditions i'm i'm assuming that i believe this is expedition set um Expedition. No, no, no. This is Fire Red Leaf Green. This is Fire Red Leaf Green. EX Fire Red Leaf Green. Expedition wasn't uh, EX. So uh, Expedition was E, e Series E Reader uh, sets. Uh, and then we have the Swalot from EX Hidden Legends, followed by the Team Aqua's Cacnea slash Grass and Darkness pre release card from Team Magma and Aqua. So very nice to add those to the collection. Thank you so much for throwing those in. And then what do we have here? I think I'm gonna open up whatever's in this. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I believe this is Entei. Volcanoes erupt when it barks. Unable to restrain its extreme power, it races head long around the land so this is definitely an Entei uh promo card and then here what is this yo i'm opening this i do not care right now get in your zone uh okay yeah i'm in the zone right now let's do it okay you guys let's check out the back really quick of this card it looks phenomenal, you guys. I don't see anything wrong. We have a Celebi. Oh, baby. We got a Celebi promo. Pokemon Forever. I have never seen this card. Promo card number 50. Oh, my goodness. It's probably worth more if you keep it sealed. But I'm not really that much of a sealed collector, if you know what I mean. So we're going to open up this one. And then this. Oh, this kind of taught you that if you had the Game Boy Advance, you could attach this and then scan the card. At the bottom here, you could have scanned like, the card here and you would be able to get it in the actual Pokemon game that you're playing. I'm pretty sure that's how it worked. Like I'm almost positive, 95% sure that's how it worked. All right, just like that, we got the Celebi going in right there. And that's pretty cool. Blastoise right there, Pokemon right there. 
Um, all right, you guys, that is gonna be the entire box opened. I definitely think we, we got more than our money's worth. Um, so just for that, let's just open up these packs. We are at 30 minutes, that's okay. Only two cards per pack, you guys. So out of the first one, we got a Torkoal and a Plusel Pop Series 1. These, these Pop Series packs are pretty expensive these days, but I'm doing it for the content, you guys. So if you guys are enjoying it for the content, did I just bend this thing? Be sure to like the video, subscribe if you are new. We got a starter Pokemon from base set Bulbasaur and a Love Disc coming out of Pop Series 2. On to Pop Series 3. Now, the only way to get a Gold Star would be from Pop Series 5, the Espeon and the Umbreon Gold Stars. And they're not even holographic, just a little shine on the on the Gold Star itself. So here we go. We got a Marsh Tomp and a Fortress. And last but not least, we have our Pop Series 4. These are just for fun to open. But for those of you guys who don't know, I'm actually on a mission to complete the Master Set. I mean, I, I've, I've nearly completed the Master Set. Uh, I'm just missing, of course, the Gold Stars for Pop Series 5. But that is very explainable because uh, they're expensive. We have a Squirtle. Very cute. Can we get a rare? Ah, chicken. We got a Wobbuffet with Nap and Expand. Oh my goodness, you guys. Let me quickly go over all the really cool stuff that we got. We got these awesome Ho-Oh pins with the Pikachu pin. We got my boy Entei. We got the Togepi pin. We got this awesome Charizard coin from 2005 World Championship Tournaments. That is really cool. Oh my gosh, we got the pre-release cards. All the different sets from EX era. You know what I'm saying? Look at that. We got Matang, Tentacruel, Ken uh... Cacnea and the Swalot. Very epic. Oh my goodness, you guys. And of course, I, I mean, this was definitely the highlight of the opening. And, uh, and uh, apart from all the exclusive stuff, like those magazines, the magazines were really cool. We got these awesome cards from the Unseen Forces, you guys. Hopefully it convinces you enough that this guy is honest and he has some really cool stuff. As you guys just witnessed, we got ourselves this awesome Celebi promo never seen this before in my life we got ourselves an ex and a freaking gold star you guys out of four packs i really hope you enjoyed maybe i'll do another one in the future for like a thousand dollars more than this one and who knows what we will find in that mystery box so i hope you guys enjoyed remember if you guys want to participate in this box break and purchase packs be sure to dm me on instagram or shoot me an email my email is linked down below it'll say mr one t's email and then the email will be shown so i'll catch you guys later you guys i'm gonna go um I'm gonna, I'm gonna go straight to editing this video for you guys oh my gosh but i hope you guys enjoy and thank you again to locomotive underscore breath underscore y2 k for this awesome mystery box oh my goodness i'm definitely gonna be contacting you soon for another one i can't wait to see what else you got uh in store for me love you guys have a good one, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Mr. 1T signing out. Peace.